Hello everyone, I'm Lois and today I'll be reviewing about Diptyque's Dossin Eau de Toilette. First of all, Diptyque is a luxury French company known for their high-end niche scented candles, perfumes, face, and body care. Most of their perfumes gravitate towards on the heavier, musky, aromatic scents. And so if you're the kind of person who likes these kinds of scents, then I would say this one is for you. Most of their perfumes are unisex, but there's specific ones that are exclusively for women, like this perfume. So this perfume comes in different sizes. Comes in 50 ml, 100 ml, 7.5 ml perfumed oil, and 3.6 gram solid perfume. What I have here is the 50 ml Eau de Toilette, and I had this for quite some time now. As you can tell, it seems like I haven't used it very much because technically you only need a few spritz here and there because as soon as you put lots of it in your clothes or skin it becomes this very overpowering, almost cloying, musky floral scent. So for top notes we have Orange Blossom from Morocco, Galbanum, for the middle notes we have Tuberose, Moroccan Iris, Turkish Rose, Egyptian Jasmine, and lastly for the base notes we have Amberwood, Benzoin, White Musk. For me, it smells mostly like Jasmine as you get a whiff off of the bottle, but as soon as you put it on your skin or clothes, it transforms into a beautiful combination of Benzoin, Amberwood, and Jasmine. The sillage of this perfume, I would say, is between a moderate to heavy and its longevity is a moderate to long lasting. This scent usually lasts till the very next day on me. I would say, if you would like to get a similar scent that is much less expensive, go for the Gucci Bloom perfume as both of these perfumes have similar middle notes. Also, this is definitely perfect for fall or winter due to its heavy undertone scent. Now you're wondering, where can you get this? So you can get this off of um, DeepTeakParis.com, Nordstrom, and if you live in Canada also, you can find it at Halt Run Through. Anyways, I hope you like this video and find this quite informative. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you.